Hi guys, this is the Overrated Underrated Show and that's me, Dr. Martin Bexman. Glad you're here, you know what you've got to do. Thumbs up, share, like it, comment it, whatever, do all that. And today it's the real summertime topic, what we've got today is. And that's it, I've been asked, what about going on holidays for four weeks or even five weeks during the summertime? Do I have to feel bad about it as a boss or what should I do? And I can tell you. You need to train that as soon as you can when you're very young orthodontist or dentist. Do that best very in the beginning of your career that you have time for your holidays. Because you teach your team to do some work without you or remote work. It doesn't mean that your team should do something that's illegal on their own, but they can do certain tasks on their own and you can help them via iPhone, via um, your mobile phone, via um, dental monitoring or all the things or with Zoom meeting, you can be there for them when they need you. So that's very, very simple nowadays with all the access to the internet wherever you are. So you should use that and apply that to your practice as well. Because as the sooner you will be replaceable in your practice, the better your practice will work. Sounds for some of the bosses may be strange, but that's the case. When when you can be replaced, everything's run smooth even without you. There's no headache when you're ill or when you want to go on holidays. When you want to sell your practice later on, it's even better because everyone can take over a running system. So you need to be replaceable. And for that, I can tell you, four or five weeks holidays are absolutely underrated.